Hello YouTube. Uh it's Kirk uh here with some exciting news. Uh today's an exciting day. Uh my new Indiana Jones hat just came in the mail. Um and I'm super excited about it. Um it looks awesome. It's a Raider style indie custom uh from Peter Bros. Uh Peter Brothers hats. And um oh I waited about twelve ish weeks for it. Uh but it's finally here and I'm super excited. It's, I mean, it's perfect. Uh, I got the uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark look in soft rabbit felt and it's just awesome. I couldn't be happier with it. Uh, so I wanted to do this video because I'm a big movie nerd, big costume nerd. And, uh, oh, I, you know, Indiana Jones has been, I've always, you know, I've always loved Indiana Jones. Um, and a long time ago when I was a little kid, I got this guy, which I'm sure like a lot of people have. Um, it's the, uh, oh, the, it's the Indiana Jones hat you can get at Disneyland, um, or, uh, you know, any of those theme parks. Um, and a lot of like the, the, the people that go for accuracy don't like it because there's a lot of inaccuracies, um, in it, but it's still a good hat. And. Um, I will actually go out on a limb and say the more you wear it, the better it looks. You know, when you first get it, it looks a little stiff, looks a little awkward. Um, but the more you wear it, it does look better with time and age and if it gets dirty and whatnot. Um, that being said, uh, if you just want to, like, compare... Sorry, I'm trying to use my webcam. Compare these two hats. Um, you can see... You can kind of see, like, some inaccuracies and uh differences uh in the two but overall uh the like officially licensed uh Raiders of the, or Indiana Jones hat like from Disneyland they're not bad hats especially if you're on a budget um they're they're decent hats um but i felt like it was time to get um to get you know a, a really nice really accurate one and this one is this one is just superb um, I, I don't have enough good things to say about this Peter Bros hat. Um, oh, I was a little, um, I wasn't, uh, skeptical. I was just a little leery ordering from, uh, Peter Brothers only because on different forums, um, and, uh, YouTube videos, you don't see a whole lot of, uh, Peter Brothers. It's all about Adventure Built, uh, Penman Hats, Akubra, and, um, you know, I didn't have a whole lot of reference, so I researched uh, Peter Brothers um, and just tried to, like, learn about them on their website. Like, they, the, the pictures of the hats looked pretty good, and it was a decent price for the different hats out there. So I went ahead and went for it, and I'm so, I'm so glad I did. I, I can't get over just how awesome this hat is. It's, it's unbelievable quality, and... The look is great. It's very accurate to Raiders of the Lost Ark. Um, right now I'm working on doing my own little touch-ups with the shaping. Uh, but this is how it came. Uh, just out of the box. It fits perfectly. Um, I just I have nothing but good things to say about it. So I wanted to make this video just to kind of promote uh, Peter Bros. And uh, just because I feel like they don't have a whole lot of good videos out there. You see a lot of videos of Adventure Built or especially Penman Hats. They have a lot of good videos. Uh, Todd's Costumes. So I thought I would contribute mine because if you want to get a good quality um, Indiana Jones hat, especially like Raiders of the Lost Ark style, I would definitely go with Peter Bros. I feel like for the quality, it, the price is worth it. You know, you're not going to spend the same amount of money you would on like an Adventure Built uh, hat. You know, this I feel like is the best price for probably one of the better hats out there, I have to say. Um, so if you want one like mine, if uh, I'll put more pictures at the end of the video. Uh, but mine is the Soft Rabbit Felt. Um, Peter Brothers uh, offer it in Soft and Stiff Rabbit and Soft and Stiff Beaver. And I want to say they just came out with a new, new Indiana Jones hat altogether. Um, but yeah, the Indie Customs, and they do all four movie styles. They do Raiders, Temple of Doom, Last Crusade, uh, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. So whatever hat's your favorite, uh, they can do it in Beaver or uh, Rabbit. And this is the Soft Rabbit, um, but it's still pretty stiff. Um, 
so I would I would say go with the soft one because I'd imagine the stiff one would be like I don't know really stiff like um, this one's just perfect it's the right amount of like floppiness uh, so yeah uh, do your research on what hat you want and uh, indiegear.com has everything uh, everything you'd want to know uh, there's a really good video on YouTube called the Fedora Chronicles which really breaks down each fedora um, so yeah, this is my, I guess this is my plug for, uh, Peter Bro's hats, just cause this hat is awesome. Um, I'm very, very excited about it. Uh, so I'll try to, you know, this is a very long, boring, nerdy video, but I hope this helps. Um, you know, if you're out there and you're on the fence about what indie hat to get, definitely consider, um, you know, Joe Peters at Peter Bro's cause this hat's phenomenal. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot me an email, comment, whatever. Uh, I'd be happy to answer it for you, but yeah, I'll just give you the 360 of it real quick. Um, and then also have my pictures, but it's really just, you know, it's a great, great, great hat. All right, I'll shut up, let you see some pictures, and I hope you enjoy the video. Yeah, thanks for watching.